That young lady was tasked Thursday morning with taking down breakfast orders for seniors. The Pulaski County Sheriff's Office hosted a free breakfast at the Dublin Lions Club. Deputies cooked up and served up bacon, sausage, ham, eggs, and biscuits and gravy. It was good. It was really good. Some scrambled eggs and ham, orange juice. Gene Stockner says he decided to come after he got a newsletter with his water bill. So I marked it down and wrote it on my calendar to make sure I got here. <laughs> what made you want to come? I just wanted to try to talk to some of the police officers and, you know, let them know how much appreciate the work you do. Lonnie Miller was there for the company. My wife passed away about four months ago and thought it'd be a good idea just to get out and meet people and eat a little bit. It's the latest example of the sheriff's office giving back. We don't have a lot of opportunity to interact, I mean, unless they're a victim of a crime or something like that. So we just want to take the opportunity to show our appreciation and, you know, just be able to sit down and talk to them for a little bit. They've been hosting a number of community events and donating to area youth, giving out school supplies and cleats. They're always doing something supportive for the community, you know, to get everybody involved, whether it's the senior citizens like today or it's the younger generation. And sometimes they bring the two together with the most important meal of the day. Now, the money for all of that actually comes from asset forfeiture, which kind of put simply is when law enforcement seizes money or property connected to illegal drug activity. A bill that went into effect in July allows law enforcement to actually use that money to build community relationships. Wow.